In this video, I'll show you how you can fix this device doesn't support receiving Miracast. The first thing you want to do is come here and search for troubleshoot settings. Go to additional troubleshooters and in here you want to choose internet connections, run the troubleshooter on that one and then you can also run it on the incoming connections. Now once you've done that, you can close it down and then what we want to do is search for device manager. Go to network adapters in here, wherever it is, network adapters. Find your main network, which is this one. You can also find it by searching for view network connections and you'll be able to see the name here. Right click on it, update driver, browse my computer. Let me pick from a list. And then you wanna try and download uh, the first one. And if that doesn't work, try and download the other one. And if you have more, just try each one of them. Now, once you've done that, um, you just want to close it down. If it asks you to restart PC, don't do it. Just wait until we do the next step. Now, the next step is you want to come here and you want to right click on your network and open the settings. Now, on Windows 10, just follow what I do. You want to go here and then you want to go change advanced sharing settings. On Windows 11, you want to just go to your network settings and then there will be a button called advanced network settings down here somewhere. And inside of there, there will be one called advanced sharing settings. Now, once you click on that, you should come to a page similar like this and you want to turn on network discovery. Once you've done that, you can just close it down. And then the last thing we want to do is we want to come in here and search for services, open it in here, press anywhere and press D look for the DNS should be anywhere here, DNS client, double click it. And then we just want to make sure that it is running and automatic. Once we've done this, we want to just close down our PC and restart it and then it should hopefully work. Now, as a last resort, if none of these work, come here and search for network reset, reset it. And then you want to unplug your router inside your house and then plug it back in and see if it works after that. Now, I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe as it helps me out a ton. Thank you so much for watching.